At the present time, Montana has about 4.6 million acres that are held fallow every year. And traditionally, that fallow acres has been used to accumulate water so you could grow a crop a year later. We've found enough research to suggest that we can annually crop this land, or maybe three out of four years, with crops that use very little water. And these would be pulse crops, peas and lentils, or cover crop mixtures that we might either plant in the fall or in the spring that would be uh, used as feed or pasture for, for livestock. In this way, those 4.6 million acres, instead of producing no revenue, will produce revenue. Part of our research experiment or project is to adapt this pea and cover crop system to our areas of the state that get say 12 to 14, maybe 15 inches of rainfall. And this means finding the right varieties, the right cropping systems, actually using very innovative uh, precision agriculture uh, for uh, fertility, for weed management, for pest management. So it's a very, very complex and overarching project. The on-farm precision experiment uh, project is in response to the incredibly huge amount of data that we now have coming into farms. So we're trying to use that data as much as we can uh, to improve farmer decisions to maximize their, uh, their profits on their farm. The idea here is that precision agriculture is one that focuses on little pieces of the field and by collecting information as we move through the field with our machinery, we can basically determine what the best approach is to farm a piece of that field. Within those different areas, we'll put different levels of nitrogen fertilizer to see what the response is. So what we start to do is perfect exactly where we get a response to those inputs like fertilizers, weed control, etc. If we combine the yield information, the protein information, uh, soil information, information from satellites that's telling us what the vigor of the crop is early in the season, we can make a pretty good prediction of what the yield is or is going to be. We want to automate this system to the degree that makes it really simple for farmers. Basically all they have to do is agree to do it or flip a switch and it will happen. This project really addresses everything from planning, uh, carrying it out, what are the, the barriers to doing this and then addressing those barriers. And uh, you know, 18 to months isn't very much time to get this done, but it's a program custom made for Montana.